let us make network for this given relationship activity a b c d e f g predecessors none none a a c b c b and d e so what is our initial analysis about this that who will start it who will end it and if at all there are any dummies who will start it now we should be knowing by now all activities who do not have a predecessor who are those a and b a and b will be starting my network a and b who will end my network all those activities who do not feature in this list we have a b c d e so f and g are not in this list so they will be ending this network who all f and g are there any dummies let us check how do we check we go through this predecessor list if there is anybody who is spoiling the um, grouping at times it is combining with someone else at times it is combining with someone else then we make use of a dummy to resolve the conflict let us check how a a is here alone a is here alone so as far as a is concerned no issues b b is here in this predecessor list with c b is once again here but again with c so it b is okay as far as c is concerned it is seen at two spots but both times with b so c is also good to go a b c are clear d is seen only once e is seen only once so there are no issues at all so what about dummies there are no dummies so we can go ahead and make this network remember it is not at all necessary that the network that we make in first go will be a fair one yes we can try to make them better by forcing what events are about to happen like if i see like this time we are stuck we'll see how do we rectify it a and b are good to go they are starting the network c and d both are waiting for a now i know that c will be combining with this in any case let me take c over here and then we'll see what to do how do we troubleshoot it c and d both are coming from a e needs cb now i'm stuck my c is there b is here i cannot take this thing like from here that is not good i cannot bring it here that again is not good what i'll try and do is i'll cut it and i'll call it t i'll cut this one and i'll call it c i'll remove this event and extend it to b so what i've done is i've swapped them so now my c and d are together here i have c and b c and b will give me e and f f i know that it will be ending the network so i'll pull it long and then we are through with e and f g is waiting for d and e here we have t let us pull this t to e and from here i'll get g so this is our network this is how it looks now we can make a fair one because this one is a cluttered one let me see how i can do this here we have a b and c d e f and g this is my final network now let me check if i have made a correct one or maybe i might have missed something so let us go ahead and just check it if i have done it correctly
ओके सो विल गो हेड एंड चेक इट वॉट आर द एक्टिविटीज इज ए बी सी टी ई एफ जी दीज आर द एक्टिविटीज डोंट लुक एट दिस वी विल नॉट लुक एट दिस Rather, we will only concentrate here and on our network. Okay. Now, according to this network, A is starting here, so it is not waiting for anyone. Nobody is completing over here. Same is with B. B is also starting here, and nobody is completing over here. So A is waiting for no one. B is waiting for no one. But as we see, C is starting from here. D is starting from here, and who is ending over here? only a so c and d probably from my network are waiting for a to finish its task fine what about e and f e is starting from here f is starting from here and they both are waiting that b and c should complete their task e is going from here f is going from here but b is coming in c is coming in so b and c are coming in and e and f are leaving so e is waiting for b and c f is waiting for b and c and g is waiting for g is coming from here and it is waiting for d and e d and e so this is my predecessor relationship for this network now if this is correct let us check we have a dash dash a a then there is a c b c b d e c b c b and t e so this network is correct that we have made we'll practice some more questions in other videos thanks for watching bye bye